All right, welcome to the Foul Mouth Al Show, everybody. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Foul Mouth Al, episode 109. That was uh, Christian Alexander, who yeah. has disappeared into the great unknown. Lord knows where he is. What a good singer. But yeah. uh, he's out there in the universe somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. Dawn, where is Christian Alexander? Argentina. He's in Argentina. And what's he doing there? Dawn is our resident psychic. Yeah. I know. And uh, hamburgers. She, he's fucking hamburgers in Argentina. <laughs> she predicted that Chilling the Rabbits would be an hour and a half late, and she was dead on with yeah! that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And uh, so they did show up out of. Uh, so what? You guys got four members? Yeah. Yeah. And two of the four showed up, so that's half fifty percent. Yeah. Are the other half gonna show up? Hand. <laughs> he did doing what? Punching a wall. Oh. All right. Well, before we get going, I just want to say Squig is here with me as always. Let's give him a hand. Our studio director, video Mike Clarkson's over there. Let's give him a hand. Hey, hey, hey. Dawn is Mike. here to my uh, left tonight. Let's yeah. give her a hand. She's here for slapstick and uh, talk about her porn site. And then uh, we've got uh, Angus Grimley on video camera there. And of course, Munchie in the back chewing on food. What do you got going back there? She is awesome, isn't she? Look, she gave us a great description with a mouthful of food. Dawn talks like that too. You and Dawn should do. You and Dawn could do a review, a food review, where you talk with your mouth full. That would be great. Talk about food. Yes, and guys would watch that. Wouldn't you guys pay to see that shit? Hot chicks eating with food, mouthfuls of food, talking. Hot gravy. Yeah, they're telling us about yeah gravy dripping down her chin and shit. I want like baked beans. Hot dog. And mashed potatoes. Baked beans with like hot dog bits cut up inside. We can make that happen at randomfilth.com. Yes, we can. So, and we're here with uh, the um, members Frankie and Timmy. Timmy from uh, oh, yeah. from Chillin' the Rabbits. Welcome, guys. Welcome to the Foul Mouth Owl Show. So, what the fuck? Why are you guys so late? Tell me all about it. Yeah. Come Let's on. Hear Rain. It. Rain. His phone not working. We yeah. went the wrong way. Well, no, we went the right way. Then it was like, I think we're going too far. So, we're going to turn around. Turned around. Went like three miles that way. Then we're like, hold on, wait. And blah, blah, blah. Something's we temporary. stopped and asked this girl for directions. Gave us a Oh, friend. you fucked up there, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and anyways, we finally got here. And here we are. Here you are. Thanks for coming. Yeah. So where did you guys come from? Denton. Where the hell? Where? Henderson, Denton. man. Denton? Yeah. You're from Denton? I'm from Denton. He's from Henderson. Henderson? Two places in, in Maryland yeah, that I'm kind of from. Yeah. Yeah, Leah. So like Denton's what, forty minutes away? Uh yeah, about forty minutes to an hour. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Depends on where you are, I guess, in Denton. Yeah, yeah well you don't drive like Al. Yeah, you get a lot of traffic over there in Denton too. I yeah. Think. Last oh, time I was in Denton, I think they had like three hundred people or four hundred people in the town. I don't know. <laughs> That's got awesome. More than that there. Yeah, well, all that the Asian day. city traffic, and with the rain, you know, everybody's on the road, right? Yeah, you're right. Yeah. So that's the main road is 404 going through Denton. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, um, goes to the beaches. Goes to the beaches from where to the beaches? Uh, the Bay Bridge. <laughs> the Bay Bridge? Yeah, like on 404, you can either go to the Western Shore, like to Baltimore or, or Washington, D.C., or you can go to Ocean City. Gotcha. Gotcha. And we're right in the middle. So you're right in the middle. Awesome. So you guys have it. Somebody says here, I got notes here today from my producer the Foul Mouth Al Show, Squig. Yeah! <laughs> yes. Clap, motherfucker. You don't have to applaud every time I mention your name, dickhole. Yeah! <laughs> awesome. Yeah. So uh, it says here, hip-hop, new wop, groovy blues, and rock in your face. Yes. That's the sound. Who came up with that slogan? That would be uh, Frankie. Frankenstein. Frankenstein. So, hip hop, new wop, groovy blues, rock in your face. So, um, that's something that I'm not familiar. You got hip hop and blues rock, groovy blues rock. Well, I guess we're gonna get a live performance here. You guys brought some guitars, I see. Yes. Man, got, I wish I was high for this. We got a 12 string with a electric cover on the uh, hole. Who made that shit? I did. Hmm. Did you? That's pretty awesome there. Yeah, it actually plugs in and works and all. Yeah, I was going to say, it looks like it, it, it could be functional. It totally is. You just strap the electronics onto an acoustic. Yep. Mm-hmm. I said strap on. Stra- Ooh, <laughs> that's awesome. Do you use a strap on? Strap on, strap. Like I would for you, Squig. You would, yes. <laughs> Why would you use a strap on and not yourself? Because I'm not touching you with her dick. Getting both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Whose dick? Your dick. 
weren't supposed to tell anybody. Well, shit, <laughs> shit flips out every once in a while. <laughs> It does, doesn't it? Yes, it does. It must be too small. <laughs> <laughs> Sneezed or something. It's an overgrown clip, but we don't talk about that. Oh, she so tucks oh, it in? Boy. Yeah. Oh, my God. It pops out like a like a skin tag. <laughs> Who the hell are we talking to earlier? I enjoy it. Now, we were talking earlier. I don't know why the hell I'm on this conversation now. But yeah, somebody well. was telling us uh, something. That uh, they don't never eat pussy because it always stinks. Mm. And who was that? Who was it? It was mm. Video Mike Clarkson. Video Mike Clarkson. Yes. yes. And I All replied right. to that. If Wait you... a second. What are you talking about? You know what you t- we're talking I didn't about. Hear you. I wasn't paying attention. I was laughing at myself on this. It you... doesn't matter. You're good. Don't worry about you it. You said you don't eat pussy. Because it always stinks. Because it always stinks. <laughs> and I told him he needs to find some better girlfriends. Yeah. Or <laughs> What do you want to smell my dick like a fine Cuban cigar, motherfucker? <laughs> Dawn seems intrigued. <laughs> From 70s bush to the tip. <laughs> Squig, you got 70s bush? Yeah. yeah. I don't believe it. Show the camera. Oh my God, I'm sorry. Nah. <laughs> don't feed the cat. I wasn't. I stepped on it. Oh, don't step on my cat. <laughs> Don't feed it, don't step on it, don't put it in a fucking oven. Jesus Christ, what are people doing with my cat? The cat has shitting problems. She has bowel issues. There's a reason why. Like video Mike Clark. Because motherfuckers step on her all the time. (laughs) Don't be stepping on (laughs) my motherfucking cat. I stepped on it when I got here. All right, so new uh, new wop, hip hop, groovy (laughs) blues and rock. Sound with a stellar live performance. How long have you guys been performing? Two years. Two years. Maybe three. Mm-hmm. Maybe well, three. Well, it was two years of Chillin' the Rabbits. Me and him played back in high school in, like, 2004, 2005. Is that right? Yeah. His first show was at Sonar in Baltimore, which is a big club in Baltimore. Mm-hmm. And from there, we played ever yeah. since. I got on some, uh, I got on the singer's shoulders and everything. Yeah, Almost hit like my this. head on the ceiling and stuff. <laughs> Just, like, ripping it up. Tearing cool. it up. But ever since then, we've been playing. I play drums in this band now because they already had two guitars and a bassist. So I was like, well, you know, I used to play drums in the marching band and all that stuff. And that's how that came. Hey, can you guys, um, you get on his shoulders and both play your guitars like badass? Like you look like one of those, like, yeah. arm creatures? Damn right. Let's do that shit. <laughs> You're going to be on the bottom. No, we're going to put a hang noose around your neck. If you guys slip up. All right. Well, they got some uh, some cool guitars here, (laughs) and um, they're going to play some songs for us. Check out the Facebook page for some images. We're going to take some pictures at the end of the night here and have them up on the Facebook page in the next day or two. So don't forget that. I don't. Check us out. Squig, you ain't, you don't never, he never went on it this week. Um, I loaned him an iPad that was given to us by, um, by Miss Dawn. Yes. Contributing to the studio in many ways. In many ways. Yeah. What? Many ways. In the set. What was done with that eye thing? See, now if you had your headphones on, you would know. I'm listening. You, didn't, you missed that part of it. Oh, Lord, women. I was I too busy know. thinking about this. What? what were, tell us what oh, you were thinking about. Porn. I was. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking porn. What kind of porn were you thinking about? I was thinking about strap-ons. That's what we were just talking about. Fet life? Yeah. No, just porn. How? Huh? Tentacle porn. Oh, it's an Asian thing. <laughs> tentacle porn? You guys know what tentacle porn is? Instead of using strap-ons or the like, they use like octopus tentacles. Oh my God, to do what? What do you think? Put in your ass? Yeah, everywhere. Or wherever. Oh, okay. <laughs> everywhere. What everywhere do you, you like, tentacles. put it through the whole body and it yeah. just like comes out every orifice? And, and it also works for men because you, you can get, get a good grab on. <laughs> yeah. Just, yeah. Just, like, whip it so back. you could just basically <laughs> swallow an octopus and it'll just stick shit out of every hole you got and be like, Vah! <laughs> That'd be cool as shit. Uh, yeah, it would clean your shit out, too. <laughs> I imagine yeah. you would feel refreshed be, after that. Oh, no. Let's do this. It's better than them colonics they give you, where they rinse out your bunghole. Yeah. Oh you had that done, didn't you, Don? <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time ago. Well, how but, did it feel? It was refreshing, wasn't it? I loved it. Did you, did you run and jog after that? No, you have mm-hmm. to stay in the house for like 24 hours. Why? Did it hurt it? No, you'll... You may have diarrhea. You're required to wear a butt plug and yeah, diapers. A and vibrating diapers. one. A butt plug? <laughs> I can't wait till I'm old enough for adult diapers, first. man. It's going to be great. Yeah, I can't wait. I don't have to get up. You just let it rip. You, know you, use, you use the pull-ups. 
I go to the bathroom at 1, 3, and 7. <laughs> I know you do. In the morning? That's my regular movements. Sometimes he sends me pictures. Yes. You put that on Poop's phone. So you guys are working on a few events. Tell us about them. Uh, we're about to go up to New Jersey, Atlantic City, and do a three-day festival there. What's the festival called? Elephants for Autism. It's a benefit. And it's at uh, the Land Grant from Oz. We're also playing May 11th at the Runhead Coffee House in Easton, which is near the Avalon Theater. It's not as big as the Avalon Theater, but it's near it, so it's, it's, all that. it's the same thing. Yeah, and so, then Summer Stock, which is really cool because it gets like 20 bands in there, and like all these people come from all and around. that's right in uh, Seaford, actually. When's that going to be, Summer Stock? Sometime in June. Sometime I'm not in sure, June. But there's, uh, there's an event page for it if you go to Facebook and just search <coughs> Summer Stock for it. You can find it on Facebook or just go to Chill the Rabbit. And what about the uh, Sports Zone Free Thinkers Ball May 29th? Yeah. That is oh, going to yeah, be an gonna awesome, be awesome show. That's going to be an awesome show. You guys are going to be there with a social state. Or is it just going to be you guys doing the acoustic it's be thing? It's going to all four of us with that. And it's going to be three guitars and one bass. And it's, it's going to be awesome. Can't wait. Can't wait. Cool. Very good. I can't wait to see that. It's going to be a lot of fun. So that's May 29th at the Sport Zone in Smyrna, 235 Stadium Street. Check them out on Facebook, Sport Zone um, Restaurant and Sports Bar. And they also have the website, Sport Zone, www.sportzonede.com. It's going to be an awesome time. Come out there with some awesome music. The last Wednesday of the month. 235 Stadium Street. Smyrna, Delaware. Yes, man. 19977. Ooh, mm. you threw that in on me. <laughs> the last Wednesday of every month, we have an event there called the Free Thinkers Ball, where we have some original music and we try to do a networking event. It's bike night, though. Yeah. So bring out the artists, bring out the bikers. <laughs> and be ready for a huge crowd. We'll all have some wine and beer and, and liquor and see what happens. <coughs> Who's going to liquor? Let's the, bring the liquor. The bikers would like it's a professional liquor. With wine. Yeah, yeah, an ass liquor. Where are you going with wine? All the pussies with wine over there. All you fags with beer over here. <laughs> Give me that moonshine. Huh? The liquor guys think it's pussy shit. I Mike use does. beer to, to wash my ass in the morning. Hey. I, I, I use beer for my cereal. Didn't you hear? Give me Mike. Dude, what about <laughs> chocolate milk? Just put chocolate syrup Hold on, let me, give, let me give Video Mike a voice. Let me give him his voice back. He got it revoked in the last episode. <laughs> he, he gets carried away. We might have to hey, unplug hello. him again. Hello? Hello? I can't hear nothing. We can hear you. Yeah, that's all you get. Hello, I can hear myself now. Thank you God. Did you miss me any? Yes. I, I did. Oh, I feel so good. Not. Now. Not. I only get to see your forehead and your head. <laughs> that's all you need to see, my friend. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I have the brain here, okay? <laughs> yeah. He's like Pinky in the brain. brain. Yeah. He's sitting yeah. all over there by himself. The world. He's trying to take. We're trying to take over the we're world, like the Pinky. foul mouth owl world. So, but Mike's always over there crunching. He ain't listening to what we're saying half the time. So that's why we talk about it. And he loves having that mic in his hand. <laughs> Ooh, boy. Oh, uh, let's hear something, Mike. What do you want to hear? I'll uh, just say something. something. Yeah, do your rap. Here, you can I play something over? Wait, you want me to rap? Yeah, okay, rap. Okay, here we go. Check it, check it, check it, check it, check it from the top now. Check it, check it, check it from the top now. Here we go, here we go. I don't care what it's like when I'm rocking. Everybody knows I'm the dick they jockin'. And the girls coming at me realize when they coming, no nothing for free. Hit the street every day and I grind. You need to realize when it is from the top of my mind. It's like I got the biz inside my brain. And realize I'm that dude going to make his own lane. You ain't seen nothing yet coming. So when you're coming at me like you want to see something. When you've never seen something. So sit back and recognize. Pay attention, dog. Right before your eyes. You see another story. Nothing crazy, nothing true. You realize and I let it go. And what do I do? I said, I'm making money, son. You ain't never See nothing funny, motherfucker coming at me, and I ain't getting no money. Yeah. Yeah! yeah good. Good. Look, at the, look at the talent pool down here at ECL Studios. Fuck yeah, man. Yeah. So we bring in a few artists with guitars, and the fucking producer sitting in the back <laughs> fucking starts rapping. <laughs> He's ripping beats back there. I gotta say, I'm proud to work with you guys. I am proud to work with you guys. Oh man, it's a hallmark moment. Especially you, Squig. <laughs> Especially you, Squig. Oh, thank you. Yeah. You ain't done a fucking thing on the last two months, but we love you anyway, Squig. 
clap, clap. That was he's, the nicest thing he's ever said. He's been he's been working hard and uh, getting shot down often, but uh. It's um, kind of depressing. Remember you told me? It is. Me? I told it's you. It's very depressing. But you got to keep him. Like, this is why don't they like me? Swing, right? You know why? Because we do it for guys like Chill and the Rabbits who come down and hang yeah. out with us. You know, not everybody can make Chill it down us. here. A lot of people here to foul mouth Al show and they run for the hills. I look and yeah. say that Squig is working hard us. and it's hardly working. <laughs> he loves it. But he's working. Sound like he's Put working him on right? Echo Talk. Yeah, it's like it's like it's like video mics in his own world over there. <laughs> yeah, he was up on a podium in the middle yeah. of Madison Square Gardens. <laughs> yeah. Give us give us a speech, Mike. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen of the round table, the foul mouth Al show, listen. We need to be prepared before we go on this mission. That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so so do you guys got a couple of songs you want to do for us? Yes. So uh, let's uh, let's talk about that. What's the first song you're gonna do for us? Saddled. <coughs> yeah. All What's right, it this, called? It's called Saddled. Super awesome, terrific, lovely day. Saddled. Super awesome, terrific, lovely day. Saddled. Yeah. Can I take my jacket off real quick? Um, as long as you got your deodorant on. <laughs> and it costs in. money. If you want, if you want Dawn to hang it up, she charges twenty bucks. Yes, it's okay. I got it. That's how we get paid. No, it's not optional. <laughs> you already got your jacket on. All right, kids, go. Who's singing? We're both hard. <laughs> Look, they're both just playing. Maybe you guys. I had it too before. <coughs> Turn my mic back up. I had it down Look, there. I got up to call and so the song was called Saddled. So that was a shorty. That was a short song. We have a lot of short songs that are like that. Well, let's hear another one. What else you got? California. Yeah, I like that. I like that. California. I always wanted to go to California. You want to go? Yeah, right now. Close your eyes and listen to this song. All right, we're there. All right.
Yeah, I'm going, yeah, I'm going to live my life of adventure, but I've got to leave my loved ones behind. What I've got to do is look forward and let my love for you die. That was super fantastic. That was video approved. I loved it. Banner, 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 banner. I could hear banjos playing in there with you guys. I feel like I'm at Deliverance Land. Have Captain Blue's Grass Band. Do you know who Captain Blue's Grass Band is? Nah. No. Uh, it's the DJ from uh, 93 Five The Beach. He actually has a band called Captain Blue Blue's Grass Band. Oh, cool. And it's they're really good. Yeah, they do bluegrass. Uh, what kind of music do they do? Uh, like folky yeah. rock. It's like bluegrass. More folky than I think. Bluegrass. Well, you can get bluegrass now. Medical marijuana, boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? Not medical marijuana. So what kind of guitar are you playing there, uh, Timmy? This is a, a Tacamine. <gasps> That's my first guitar. It was... Munchie, Andy can you play? Yes, <laughs> not can, well. What can you play? Uh, not much. Stairway to Heaven? <laughs> I can play Stairway to Heaven. Let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> not really. I can play... Here, let me see it. Let me try to play something. You want foul mouth out to play something? To play oh, hell yeah. Oh, you know what? Here, may I? What do we got here? Yes. Uh, pig. Okay, Great bust dawn in the mouth with a fucking uh, guitar thing. Poker here. eye out me with and, a fucking Me and Munchie are going to do a uh, jam out here. Oh, this is crazy, man. Yeah, but Sean. What are you doing, Sesame Street? <laughs> you got it. Uh, Maybe not. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not good at finger playing. I'm not good at finger picking. What are you playing? Making it up? quick on that. What are you playing? I know it. What is it? Oh, uh, um, um, uh, what is it? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Yeah, such a big, I know it. <laughs> it's like, it's like, it's right there. Mm. It's where is it's, it? Where is it's it? like, it's like right, like, I can't, I, I, I can't it. reach like, it. Is it soft, Kitty? <laughs> it's, um, <laughs> blinded by the light. Who can name this song? Ready? What is this? I can't tell you, man. Are you uh, making it up? What is it? Uh, you know what it is. I don't know what it is. <laughs> 
He I don't that. know about a thing I said, but your mama might be found if you get dead. See, I told you he knew it. I'm like, I, I know it, but he knows it, and I can't figure it out. You know a lot of shit, but don't know how to talk it. No. All right, Munchie, like, play something. I can't get it right. <laughs> play something, and I'll follow you. No. No, do that. I'll follow you. Just play something. Okay. Play a chord progression. One, one beat. You're dying to talk, man. No, I'm not. That's the uh, ECL Studios band. Back to the professionals. Hip, hip. Get the guitars back to the professionals. Hip, hip. No. <coughs> what happened there? How the hell did me and Munchie end up with instruments? <laughs> what you is asked. wrong with us? <laughs> and you shall receive it. The Found yeah. Mouth Out Show. You guys got one more song for us? Yeah. What do you want to do? Do you want to do... Do the best. All right, this Bob one's off or of the cigarette song, or... Yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, so if everybody's ready to do a cigarette break after this, <laughs> this is the song. You guys will have this in your head every day. I sing it every day. Okay. What's this called, the cigarette song? It's a cigarette song. You can sing it with us. Chord is, can I get a cigarette? Mm, every time you hear us sing it, you guys say it. All right. All right. Okay. Ready? You gotta smoke. Can I get a cigarette? Can I get a cigarette? Yeah, like one. Can I get a cigarette? Fuck, now I need a light. Can I get a cigarette? I got one. Can I get a cigarette? Can I get a Cigarette. Don't you need a cigarette? Yeah. Well, goddamn, that was awesome. I'm glad you guys came on down. Check them out uh, at the end of this month. They're going to be at the Sports Zone in Smyrna at the Freethinkers Ball. It's the only place you can see the Freethinkers Ball content is at the Freethinkers Ball and on ExploreDE.com on the Kiedy Video Magazine. Their Kiedy Video Magazine will be there taking footage. They're going to do interviews with you guys. So, people, if you want to get to know these guys a little bit better and See what their ugly asses look like, then check them out on the Kiedy Video Magazine later on this month. 
you know, you guys are rocking it out there. You've been out there for a long time, and you still you're you're in Smyrna, Delaware. What the fuck's wrong with this picture? <laughs> We're just, Sounds like you could use a little luck. How about that? Yeah. Just that's a little bit of luck. Well, we've been on 93.5 The Beach on their local produce thing like three times now. It's a good stepping stone. You need and to come to ECL Studios and talk to their director, Video Mike, yeah, about like your, about your music video. career. You yeah. need to talk to Video Mike about your music career. He has a program that can help you out. The studio has a program that can help you get your career to the next level. It's incredible. He's about to do a seminar. They're going to do a seminar where we have a couple of artists come into the studio and talk to them about you know what their career goals are and how what we can do at the studio to help them reach their their career goals. But there's something that you can do that you've never done before. See if you if you do what you've always done, you're going to get what you've always got. So if I give you something that you've never done before and you start doing it, something different's going to happen for you, guaranteed. And it's always been good luck. We've had people. What, what's some of the good stuff that's happened to people? People won money, money, uh, women, cars, yeah. fame, fortune, yeah. all the good shit that you can imagine. They have orgasms where they were numb before. I want a giant bottle oh, filled with Remember? chocolate pudding. A giant bowl filled with giant what? Giant bottle. A giant baby bottle. Oh, I thought you said a bowl filled like, with I want chocolate. This thing something. Like, what if it was just like a giant teat? Of chocolate pudding. A giant teat. <laughs> a giant teat? Uh, I'm making a cow. Not the whole cow, just the teat. The, just no, the just the otter. Just <laughs> one otter. He wants a cow that gives chocolate pudding. No, a giant go Oh. Oh, well, oh my gosh, chocolate pudding and like a go-gurt. All right, so here comes. You have to have like two people on each side going. Here comes like this. the magic, kids. Are you ready? I'm going to give you the secret. There's one thing you can do, and I guarantee you've never done it before. Okay. You look people in the eye and you nod your head yes and you say, you could tell five people about foulmouthout.com by Friday, right? Yeah. yeah I could you could tell five people Facebook. about foulmouthout.com by Friday. Your luck will change. And yes. that goes for you, the listeners out there, too. Duh. If you tell five people about foulmouthout.com by Friday, your luck will turn around and you'll start winning the fucking lottery. You'll win money. Your boss will like you. DMV line will move faster. All that shit. Be like, man, no more lines at McDonald's at two o'clock in the morning. Oh, Fucking, shit. you'll go to the bank and you'll put your and they'll give you money at the bank. Shit, shit, just crazy shit starts happening. Try it out, foulmouthal.com. You got to tell five people about foulmouthal.com, and not only do you have to tell five people, but you got to get them to tell, tell five, five people, people too. So it spreads. The word spreads like that. Yeah. So, um, so anyway, for video Mike Clarkson, Squiggity Squig, and the uh, ECL crew with Munchie and. Um, Sean Angus Grimley, <laughs> Miss Dawn here at my out. side, and the guys from Chillin' the Rabbits. Uh, oh. We're going to take you out with a song from Chillin' the Rabbits. What song you guys want to go out with? I got here, Paige here, Dimitri, Lucille, I Need Your Love, Mean Apple Pie. What do you think? Which apple one? Pie. You like Mean Apple Pie? I, I like Apple Pie. Munchie likes apple anything pie. that's got that's to do with song. food. <laughs> That's true. It's amazing. Her nickname is Munchie, right? Yeah, we'll go for We that used to one. work at McDonald's, and every time someone would order our pie, it's like, I got two mean apple pies. Is that what this song is about? No. It's about, uh, it's about loving. It's about loving? Yeah. What, fucking? Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, check it out, and uh, we'll see you guys next time on the Foul Mouth Owl Show. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Go, go. <laughs> Winnie in the box.
is Buck Duke Jack, and I love beer and football, baby. You know where I'll be this weekend at the Sports Zone, Smyrna, Delaware. Who needs cheerleaders when you got waitresses like Samantha, Nellie, and Jordan? The Sports Zone in Smyrna is where Buck Tooth Jack works. So my wife thinks. Sports Zone is a great place for half-off appetizers and $1.50 drafts at the Sports Zone, Smyrna, Delaware.